what's going on guys and welcome back to Chasing Blades. So I'm super super excited. I've been waiting for months to, for this knife and it just came in the mail. Uh, the EDC today was the Leatherman Juice S2. Um, review coming soon. Really love this thing. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up here. Got one piece of tape over there. And looks like another piece over here. So set the juice down. And oh my god, I'm so excited about this. Alright. So hang on, let me open this up off camera. Alright, there she is. Uh, nothing else in the box. Here she blows. Yes, that's right. It's a buck. And I'm so freaking excited about this. Just amazingly, amazingly excited. And uh, let's go ahead and open this up. This is very nice packaging so far. Um... Alright, you know what? Cut your gold string. Wow. Alright, let's uh let's open this bad boy up. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Alright, so as you can see we get Buck's normal nylon sheath. And here is the knife. I'll open that up in just a second. And get some paperwork out here, get the box out of the way. So, this is the Certificate of Authenticity for the Custom Buck 110. Um, if you guys want to pause that and read it. And then you get the Forever Warranty information. Uh, I'll leave that there so that you guys can pause it and read that if you want to. Um, and then you flip it over. And you get this nice message. Um, so I'm going to read the Certificate of Authenticity. Uh, your CKS-110 Folding Hunter Knife was individually crafted from the highest quality hand-selected materials using Buck's utmost standards of excellent. We hope you enjoy your knife and pleasure mate. And it was a pleasure making it for you. So the President and CEO signed this. Uh, looks like looks like real pen looks like he actually uh signed that i i quite like that um so anyway you guys know what this is now it's uh the custom buck 110 um we're gonna take a look at the box first um so it's not the regular box you've got the nice buck logo up here and limited edition and then it says custom knife and uh i put g10 handle scales on it and underneath you've got uh you know the california thing and nothing else it's a very nice box i really like it i really like the packaging um so yeah again here's the sheath um their typical nylon sheath um you know nice stitched buck logo you've got your um belt loop here so, um, I was going to go with the leather sheath, but, uh, I just decided not to and decided to go with the, uh, the nylon sheath. Um, so this Buck 110 came out to be about $118, um, 125 with shipping. And let's go ahead and without further ado, oh my goodness, look at that. Wow, this thing is heavy. Um, it's G10. I was hoping for grippy G10, but I guess that's okay. Um, so you've got nickel bolsters. This is really cold. <laughs> it just came in from outside, so um, it's extremely cold. Um, so you've got nickel bolsters here and here. Uh, this is obviously the 110. Um, I added the finger grooves, and uh, let me go ahead and open this here. Oh, yeah. 
this thing's huge but uh, you get the uh, their boss heat treat I put s30v on this and it says uh, custom knife shop on one side and then you've got the buck logo on the other the finger grooves with the finger grooves oh my goodness the just the the handhold is amazing so uh, let me zoom out here just a little bit um, so yeah this is a quite a large knife as you know the buck 110 um, the reason I wanted um, the oops sorry the uh, the buck 110 was it's a bigger folder and you know obviously the buck 110 has been around for a long time um, and I've always wanted one I didn't want just the plain one though I uh, I definitely wanted to be different and so I definitely went for different so um, sorry got to move the camera just a little bit make sure I get everything in in shot here um, so overall I'm very very impressed so far um, you'll get a full review as soon as I get some use on this but going over between the bolster and the G10 handle scales there's no rust spots it's very smooth um, it's still really cold um, as you can see just the fit and finish is absolutely amazing uh, no half stop on this but you know it locks in place and uh, yeah so um, let's see what do I want to cut um, maybe I'll cut this uh, this warranty card here I don't think I need it it's just information so let's see how sharp this puppy came and this is kind of like a flimsy, like, slippery cardstock. Oh, yeah. Oh, she's sharp. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, so, let's take a look at it in the sheath. So, I really like this sheath. Um, it's just, like I said, they're nylon sheath. Um, I was going to go with the leather one, but it was a little expensive. Hang on one second. So it holds it in there nice and tight. It's I'm shaking that pretty good and it's not going anywhere. Um, well, the clasp sort of goes over. Um, hang on. You kind of got to pull on it a little bit. It's brand new, so uh, it's going to take a while to break in. But yeah, I'm very, very impressed with this knife. Um, this is just the unboxing. Um, I will definitely give you guys a... Oh, that lock back is really tight. A full review of this knife when uh, definitely when uh, I get some more use on this. And so, um, thank you guys for watching. Um, also, look for a review coming soon. Uh, maybe today, uh, maybe tomorrow, I'm not sure. Um, but definitely look for a review on the Leatherman Juice S2. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you had a wonderful day. And uh, I will see you guys in the next one. Um, if you like the content, uh, please subscribe. Definitely more to come. And uh, I will see you guys in the next one.